Nantes were looking to snap a run of back-to-back -back league on defeats when they welcomed relegation-threatened Bastia. The Corsicans made the three-hour flight without any supporters joining them as the security measures after the attacks in Paris remain in place. Bastia without an away win for eight matches, but at least ended a run of five straight defeats on the road with a week 13 draw with Lille. Well, Nantes were quicker off the mark and Lucas Doe made a bursting run Delaying his cross before whipping it in. In the end, Jean-Louis Lecca having to save from his own defender's header. Michel de Zacharyan hoping for better from his Canaries, having lost three of the last five at home. I'm not surprised that there was then sloppy defending that almost allowed an absolute stunner of an opener. Only the face of the crossbar saving Nantes as Yannick Kouazak Beautifully lifted it over. Remy Rio, no chance. But the Bastia captain denied a stunning second ever Ligue 1 goal. However, only two sides have a worse defensive record than Bastia. Colbin Sigthorsen should have maybe pulled back after taking advantage of a mistake from Mathieu Pébern. The Icelandic forward will take his place at Euro 2016. But still just one goal since arriving from Ajax. Well, Nantes have won 22 of 31 meetings at home with Bastia. But haven't beaten the Corsicans at home in Ligue 1 since a 1-0 win in August 2002. Well, Bastia unbeaten in the last six meetings. That across Ligue 1 and Ligue 2. Nantes have only scored once. And already passing the 400-minute mark. And failing to hit the target there. Ermir Lenjani having Lecca scrambling across. Islan Printemps would have been delighted in injury time when his side had a great chance to snatch the win. Alejandro Bedoya flying into the challenge and the American picking up second booking. And Nicolas Reinville sending the midfielder off for that challenge on Seco Fofana. Well, chance for a first away win this season for Bastia. But not worth the wait, really. Gail Danich's effort straight into the thankful arms of Remy Rio, although he almost made a mess of it. Plenty of time to see that. Thankfully, gathering though before what would have been an embarrassing goal. So, no goals, scoreless, and not doing much for either side, not at least at mid table. Bastia still hovering over the relegation trapdoor.